my Aries. And she from Amethyst Rose to Rose coming through to give you guys an energy check-in. We're going to see what is the most important for you guys at this time. This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. We're going to see what's going on, Aries. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. This is for you. All right. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, Spirit Gods. What messages do you have for Aries? Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. We're going to see what's going on for you, Aries. All right. The microphone to protect me as I channel the energy for Aries. What does Aries need to know at this time? Aries, sun rising in the north node. What do they need to know at this time? All right. <clears throat> Love the Lord by SZA is on. Off the album Control. Okay. Let's see. What does Aries need to know? Thank you. King of Swords. You know, this is my God card. Somebody could be dealing with the air sign masculine, though. That's Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra. Let's see. Somebody who has a highly aspected. This is for Aries. Sun and rising in the North Node. Okay. You got the Ace of Swords. All right, then you got the Prince of Swords. That's Knight of Swords. Okay, what in the world? Somebody could be wanting to rush in and tell you some truth and clarity. What they saw, what they seen, what they did. Will of Fortune, yeah. Somebody could be getting some karma. Somebody could be dealing with the Sagittarius. Somebody could just be realizing that they love you or. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node. But something cannot be denied. So, you know, something as clear as day. Somebody got some divine truth here. Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles speaks of a collaboration. So somebody could be communicating that they want to work with you. Speaking about this, this could be a Virgo or someone who has a highly aspect. Eight of Swords. Somebody could just be seeing the truth about somebody that they work with. But somebody is going over their head about the closing of a cycle. Somebody, uh, if you were in a relationship with somebody, somebody who has gear, highly aspected, um, they're going over it in their head. Five of Wands. Okay, we finally got some fire out right here. So Aries, you could have other placements that are uh, highly aspected. Or that could just be um, this person. You know, take the reason how it resonates. Somebody is conflicted right now. Somebody could be trying to figure out how to make something work. You got the uh, nine of cups here. So somebody could be drinking heavy at this time. And just thinking. Somebody's like all in their mind. Like somebody is just... They're trying to see how something works. Somebody may be drinking just to get their their mind right or tempered or or to calm down or something like that. What, what's this going on with Aries? Princess of Pentacles. Okay, that's the page of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody is trying to. Somebody may just want to start over with you because now they view you as the uh, as the, the queen of pentacles here. Stable, solid, secure. Or that's how you view somebody else, Aries. Uh, at this point, it's just kind of, there's just, there's, uh, you know, conflicted energy here. There's somebody that's like trapped in their mind about something. They're drinking a lot. They're trying to figure out how to make something work. Somebody may be researching something. They're looking back on something. Somebody's trying to figure something out in their head, though. Tell me more, please. This is for Aries. The Ten of Cups. That speaks of emotional fulfillment. A family dynamic. 
Okay, with the Wheel of Fortune at the, at the bottom of the deck. Something could be dealing with the Sagittarius or somebody is, somebody is seeing just how hateful somebody is. Somebody that they may be, they're conflicted. It's like somebody is seeing something about somebody that they were in a family dynamic with and viewing them as hateful. It's like, I get Aries, this isn't you. This is the other person and something they're dealing with. Tell me more. What does Aries need to know or you want them to know? Okay. King of Pentacles. So somebody could have been married here or somebody could have had um, some money. Hmm. Somebody could have hid the fact that they were married. Okay. Tell me more. This is for Aries. I got the six of wands. Somebody is thinking of a master plan here of how to win somebody over or get back in somebody's good graces. Shoot it up by Tiona Taylor is on. Yeah, somebody's trying to figure out how to get back in somebody's good graces. Somebody made a made a bad judgment call. And now the something somebody is seeing through an illusion. So somebody's trying to figure out how to make something work here, Aries. So somebody may be rushing in to you and let you know that they want to work with you. They want to cooperate. They want victory with you. They see you as their wish fulfillment. They want to start over. Yeah, somebody views you as their wish fulfillment. They could have thought somebody could have been in something like a provider in another situation like a family dynamic or something like that so they felt somebody could have felt like you know they're gonna do that you know like you know like somebody could have felt like they were trapped to some kind of situation or something like that um but they don't they no longer view something the same way let's see let's get more messages for you Aries. I don't know why I was telling you their petty life, but because it's petty, they don't even have anything going on, and that that could I don't know, Aries. Maybe this is something that's on your mind. Yeah, let me shuffle again because that just you know maybe you feel like this person was hateful, you know. Or mean towards you. King of Swords energy could be somebody who's cold. You know, they're mean or something like that. And you could have seen this for what it was. You know. and But it's just letting you know what's going on. Can I get one for the Ace of Swords, please? Queen of Wands. Yeah, Aries, that's you. Somebody is seeing you for who you are. They see you as beautiful, beautiful, confident. You're a self-starter. You're a go-getter. Somebody doesn't get whatever this is. Somebody didn't get emotional about whatever this was. So whether somebody went, went, stayed, whatever. So it's like somebody didn't let it dictate what they had going on. Like somebody was just like, okay. Somebody is very... Aries, I'm getting that you... The way you moved on and the way you were willing to start over. Like you're going towards your victory. You know that your wish fulfillment is still ahead of you. Is what it looks like to me. And now this person is getting truth and clarity about you. And now they want to rush in and tell you something. Why, why is the king of swords here? I'm not, why is the knight of swords here? This person may want to give you something. 
Yeah. So whoever this person is, you know, they're gonna come back matching your energy. Yeah, the, and I mean, the, and it's destined to occur. It's gonna happen. Somebody may want to gift you with something, or this could be somebody else. I mean, you take it how it resonates, Aries. Can I get one for the King of Swords, please? Wow, Aries. Okay, the fire came out. Okay, so the first main spread was about how somebody felt about you. Okay, and then the next spread is about, it seems like the clarification is about what's coming in. Yes. Now, something is a family dynamic here. Something is dealing with family or a family job, family, but something about a collaboration. Yeah. Somebody, something is somebody's wish fulfillment, and then you got the King of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Aries, you're going to have to take this one how it resonates because something does have something to do. Can I get one more for the King of Swords? Because somebody could have like a mean father or King of Swords or the Emperor. Something could have something to do with like some kind of inheritance. What's the King? Two of Wands. Another Okay, so, okay, what's the Eight of Swords? We're getting into something now. The Four of Wands. Somebody could be fighting over a house or you got the King of Swords again. Somebody also keeps going over this relationship, this wish fulfillment in their head. Somebody somebody could just be simply obsessing about you. I mean, I don't see the Devil card. Yeah, somebody could be, you know. Yeah, look at this. This could be somebody who ghosted you or something like that. It's like somebody could be creeping, you know, kind of like watching from afar. Like they're not there, but they see you. Somebody that you in a, a relationship with. Somebody, whoever this King of Swords were, they were just controlling. Somebody tried to control the narrative here. And now they're just trying to figure out how to make something work. Yeah. Somebody, somebody wants to start over here. Because they view somebody as their emotional fulfillment, their 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 wish fulfillment. They feel like when you when they think it's like somebody thought about something after the fact. Yeah. Somebody also could be feeling like they're trapped in a relationship here. They're trapped with somebody. Tell me about the King of Pentacles. Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Pole. The Nine of Cups with Justice. Oh, wow. So, somebody could be drinking, like I said, just drinking because they're getting this karma. They're drinking to try to stabilize their, their mind. Nine of Cups, please. Yeah, somebody is just drinking because somebody is. I just seen the devil. They're drinking to try to stabilize their mind. Nine of Cups, please. Yeah, this King of Pentacles. That somebody has if something is a mirror it's like no matter what somebody tries to do they can, they run back into themselves king of pentacles the nine of cups is clarifying the king of pentacles the king of pentacles is clarifying the nine of cups it's like it's like yes it's 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 like a bad backfire here yes it's like it's like a bad backfire yeah, it's like somebody manipulated something, then judgment, then tower, then they're left out in the cold. They're poverty stricken or neglected and abandoned. People walking away from them. It's like somebody continues or stuff isn't working. It's like somebody is trying to figure out how to make something work. Like I said, how to make something a success. And it's like no matter what they try to do, they may try to move into a new place. That's getting blocked out. That's not working. It's like but it looks like Aries that somebody tried to control a situation and you two may have not matched energy. Somebody was mean, you know, thought they could be mean because they were, you know, financially set or, you know, 
But whoever this is, take it how it resonates. Somebody could have, you know, Taurus, Virgo, um, what's the other one? Capricorn or Capricorn highly aspected and they were just mean towards you. But it looks like you're going to have somebody that comes in that matches your energy. Could be another fire sign. Yeah. And it looks like you guys will collaborate together. And it will be successful. Exchange by T Bryson Tiller. Yeah. It's like somebody, something is going to be reciprocated. It's going to be equal. All right. Can we get a, a divine abundance card, please, for Aries? Divine abundance oracle. Could Aries use it this time, please? Thank you. Aries, the moon rising in the north node. We'll get divine abundance oracle please for Aries. Okay. Outrageous openness. Dear love, open me to your will. Release me from my attachment. Surprise and delight me with your plan. You know what's needed and I'm open to receive. Yeah. So stay open, um, Aries. So or just know that something is coming in, so stay open. Limitless. See yourself open to receive in the most miraculous ways. The divine can use anything and anyone. Yeah. Somebody is relentless. They're unstoppable. They're limitless. Your blessings are limitless. So just know you have a lot coming in for you, Aries. So don't look back. All right. That is your reading, Aries. Please be sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, bye.